Constantino. Dole. Pound for pound. Here we are with the one and only Chris Algieri. Chris, obviously you're doing the commentating booth for Canelo Saunders, if I'm not mistaken. It's fight week this Saturday. Break down the fight for us, Chris. You know, this is a uh, this is a big this is a big fight, huge matchup. Um, you know, Billy Joe is uh, a final round boxer, undefeated world champion, um, coming all the way over here to fight. You know, Canelo Alvarez, and I think stylistically, there's a there's a lot that Billy Joe can do that can that can cause uh, problems for for Canelo. You know, Canelo in the past has had problems with southpaws. We've all seen that guys who were slick, guys who could box, but. That was Canelo from a bunch of years ago. I think the Canelo now is a, is a whole different animal. Um, I believe he's very motivated. And I mean, the guy's been so active that he's just on such a momentum right now that I think he's gonna be hard to beat fighting from, from anybody. And, uh, but no, I think it's gonna I think it's gonna be a great fight. And I think it's gonna be very nip-tuck in the beginning, trying to figure out, figure each other out, the Southpaw Orthodox, and uh, they're gonna vie for, for control, but um, Ultimately, I'm, I'm, I'm leaning towards Canelo winning. What do you make of two parties, two different parties? One saying, you know what, we're just going to give him a boxing lesson. He's going to dance around the ring. Mm -hmm. Pop shot him. Tyson Fury said he's going to just beat him up and then go for the knockout or something, something along those lines. And then other people say, you know, that's the power of King. King. You know, he's going to just take over. Mm -hmm. Maybe BJ will win some, some of the early rounds, but then Canelo will take over as the fight goes on. Well, I think BJ, he's going to have to assert himself if he wants to win, round, win rounds here. You know, Canelo's really good at, he's a very good ring general. He understands where he is in the, in the ring, where he is in, in the round. Um, you know, he's got those fast flurries, he counters the combinations. So, you know, he's a hard guy to win rounds against, and I think Billy's going to have to, you know, be aggressive and, and throw volume. Um, you know, because otherwise he's going to find himself deep in the fight with, with not a lot of rounds in the bank. What are the keys to victory, in your opinion, for BJ? Uh, BJ needs to, to uh, lead with his jab, the southpaw jab, let his combinations go, but be careful on the way out. Canelo is a great counter puncher, so making sure that he's coming out with his hands up or staying nice and low, because uh, in the past he's gotten clipped there on the way out uh, from throwing combinations. And just be busy. I think he needs to, he needs to be a volume and keep, keep moving, keep cutting angles. Uh, don't stand right in front of Canelo and be careful on the ropes. What about Canelo? What are you going to say? You know, Canelo has to be Canelo. He's got to, um, he's got to use that snappy jab. He's got to counter with combinations like he always does. Finish to the body and uh, make sure that he's that he's not getting too flat-footed. You know, as of late, he hasn't been on his toes as much. I think he's gonna have to move a little bit more with with uh, with Billy Joe, especially as as an aggressor. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's 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 a it's a great my, uh, style matchup for sure. What do you make since the pandemic? This is the most fans that ever attend a live event. And it's boxing. It's going down this side. What do you mean? I'm excited. I'm excited. And we're you know we're close to Mexico. And we've got you know we've got a lot of people coming from from across the pond. So I think it's going to be electric in there. What do you make also? PG Saunders says that if if he beats Canelo, it's going to be amongst the top ten upsets in boxing history. And uh, Sugar Hill told me yesterday that it's going to be in the top five. Yeah, I mean, I would say so. I, that's going to be it's it would be definitely historic. You know, and um, do we know what the line is? Uh, I don't. I gotta look that up. I gotta look that up too. Yeah. But I know that, uh, if I'm not mistaken, last time I checked, Canelo was like a plus 110, 130 to her decision. Mm. So I guess the betting people think that Canelo's gonna knock him out. Wow. Okay. So if you put 100, then you would win 130. Right. Interesting. Interesting. Yeah. And um, Chris, uh, anything you wanna get off your chest about this fight, about yourself? Anything you have going on? Yeah, just I mean, this is this is great for boxing. You know, we're we're, we're getting fans back. I hope that this uh, sets a precedent that we can we can have fans. We can we can we can bring boxing back to its full capacity. And uh, and yeah, man, it's an exciting weekend. Constantino Garcia here for Little Giant Boxing. Make sure you guys subscribe and follow me on social media at Constantino Garcia.